Welcome back to the 2012 Olympic Games. My name is John Hastings and I'm here with Albert Jones, who is a little indisposed at the moment. John, I'm not. John, I'm not. I'm, this is a, this is a second. <laughs> John, John, I'm not indisposed. I'm just dying. Oh, but it's not that bad. I went down to buy a donut, but instead they gave me a ball of flour. That's a scone. Every bite is a cinnamon challenge. John, D. Yes, when you try to swallow a teaspoon of cinnamon, yes. Can't be done. Can't be done. John, I'm going to get lung damage from inhaling the powder. It's so dry. All right. Are you finished? No, I'm not finished. I'm not going to finish this thing. Do you want it? <sighs> Moving on to the next... Don't try this at home, kids. ...to the next event, which is the high jump. I am really excited about this event. Shorty and Cody really have a chance to show off their athleticism here. They're both fantastic jumpers. Both have distinct advantages, but they also have things working against them. Cody, his legs are long. He's lithe. He has spring in his jump, but he's not powerful. He still has room to grow. Shorty, her limbs are a little bit shorter. She's got more weight to her, but she is more powerful. So we'll have to see what happens. Great stuff. And we have some archived footage of both cats training at a young age. Cody, you can see building his confidence, Aww. trying to jump up on anything he can. Ah, uh, John, my heart melts. Would you look at the little sky? Gamp, John. Oh, I'm with you oh. there, Albert. Just look at him. He is a spirited young chap. Ah, John, it takes me back. Did you have a kitten, Albert? Yeah, well, no. My dog brought one home in its mouth once, punctured its lung, the poor thing. But in its last few minutes of life, we really bonded. And I got to say, ever since, I've had a soft spot in my heart for cats, John. I, I, I got to tell you. <laughs> Oh. That's a horrible story. But you know what, John? Cody didn't always have it so good. Cody grew up in a cage down by the river, abandoned um, by his... Ah, uh, but what is this? It's backstory, John. People love it. Are you sure? Makes the athletes more relatable. Makes great television. But it's not even true. Doesn't matter. People can sympathize with the athletes this way, um, John. Albert, I think people want to watch the nah, sports. Nah, John, trust me. It's going to be great. People are going to cry. The ratings are going to skyrocket. Um, I just, I just oh, but know. How about this? How about we get back to the sport and you can play your little show later? Um, okay, I guess you're the one with the big fancy degree from uh, Oxtong University. I bet it's Oxford University. Ox what? Ford. Bye, American! <sighs> Can we get back to the high jump, please? Be my guest, Oxford. And now they're warming up for their final jump. And you can see here they've carved a mark in the wall, much to the chagrin of their coach, mind you, to give them something to aim for when they jump. And oh, John, a fight has broken out. Somebody oh. break it up. It's literally a cat fight. This far into the competition, anxieties are high. Shorty apparently not happy with Cody's practice time. She wants to practice with the mark. And it's not very sportsmanlike, but these things do come to a head. Cody, too. Oh, my God. Cody doing the exact same thing. Not it's like the UFC in here. Ultimate fighting cats. <laughs> I'll give you that one, Albert. Okay, the time has arrived. It is time for Cody's final Olympic high jump. Let's watch. And Cody John. leaps into the stratosphere. It's He's bouncing amazing. off the walls. What's going on? Yes, Albert, it's not just the high jump anymore. They are pulling out all the stops. It's high jump. It's parkour. It's an urban playground. They're Spider-Man. They have taken this event to a whole new level. And my goodness, this is exciting. 
John, I can't even move. I do not know how Shorty is going to top that. It is pandemonium in here. Pandemonium. Look at the height. He, I can't believe it. He is giving it all he's got. Look at him. For the size of him, he can jump. Even if he doesn't win, he has proven himself in these Olympic Games to be a contender on the world stage. John, I can barely contain myself. Okay, Shorty is up and she is going to need a miracle Oh, Shorty, here. good luck. I can't watch. Shorty, try umphant. Look, Albert, you can look now. Look at her. She's scaling the wall. Albert, I did not expect to see this oh, from Shorty. Oh, God. I've never seen anything like it in my life. She's an anti-gravity cat. It's amazing. Nobody told me it was going to be this exciting. Oh, it is a thrilling day here on the Olympic stage. But I have a feeling the best is yet to come. Don't go anywhere, folks. We will be right back after this. John, I can't. I think I'm going to eat the rest of this scone now. Why does this exist?